Hey guys, it's Hailey. Welcome back to the channel. So I promised you a few weeks ago that I will do my impression and review on the LG Prial mask after using it every single day. Um, so I've been using it every single day, literally, um, for the last few weeks. So before we begin, what I really want to tell you is that you need to understand how the mask works in order for you to um, you know, use it to its fullest. Well, the principle behind this mask is that uh, when we usually use cosmetics, it doesn't uh, work beyond the out outer layer of your skin. So it only works on the like outer layer of your skin and it doesn't get into the deeper layers, right? So the effect of um, cosmetics is very limited. That's why when you go to a cosmetics uh, clinic, then you get deeper and better result because they actually have the you know, resources to get in deeper layers of your skin and uh, get it treated. Um, so you get good results, but because it can be a lot more um, harsh on your skin, because obviously, it has to be more powerful to get deeper into the skin, right? And so you end up having uh, the result that you want, but it ends up uh, that your skin becomes more vulnerable or dry or something like that. And so beauty device such as this one comes in, um, you know, in between uh, cosmetics and clinic because it's not perhaps as strong as the effect you would see from the clinic, but definitely stronger than just normal cosmetics routine that you will have because it does get into the inner layers of your skin and it's not as harsh to your skin as the clinic ones. So these are good um, if you are able to keep up with it every day or you know regularly so understanding that the mask helps ingredients to get into deeper layers of your skin it's important that you use it after you wash your face because if you have your makeup on you know all the toxics of your makeup will get in um, and that's not what you want and if you clean your cleanse your face um, that's good but if you don't do anything if you just have bare face and without any products on and have the mask on it's not really going to do anything for you because you're supposed to um, apply good materials good ingredients for your skin and that to infiltrate into the layers um, inner layers right this is the special routine that I have for the spring um, especially in uh, you know in in using this mask or beauty device what I do is I come back and remove my makeup completely and you know as soon as I get home and then I cleanse my face twice so I'll remove all my makeup with cleansing oil or cleansing remover and then I use um, cleansing foam and I try and make as much foam as possible because that's the way to minimize any harshness on your skin and then I use the foam to cleanse my face and I try to do this for quite a long time you know I don't know how, how long but I will say good two three minutes at least I try to you know massage in to really get in everywhere like in the corners of my face to get off all the micro dust that would have been there and then I cleanse off completely when I come out I use a serum that's very light um, and that's suitable for the springtime the one that I'm using at the moment is Biotherm's Aqua Source Deep Serum and I think this is pretty um, light and pretty uh, how do I say it anti-sensitive so anybody can use it um, and I, what I do, and I learned this from another YouTuber um, who's an expert who actually has a you know like degree or certificate and everything like that for cosmetics, that it's better sometimes um, to use the same serum um, in three layers to really get the most out of it um, instead of using multiple products at the same time. So that's what I've been trying to do. You pump a very little amount of the product um, and then use it in the most, like I guess the widest and the most dry or driest or the most needed spot of your skin, which would be the cheeks and this, you know, wide area of your face. So you do that and then you wait for it to soak in a little and then you go for a second pump 
and then you go for the wider area of your face so including your forehead you know cheeks your chin everywhere and then you wait for it to soak in a little longer you know every layer you would add on more products and then you go in for the whole face so it's simple if you think about it because I'm starting in the middle and then widening the area that I'm applying product so completely up to you know the edges of my face like this so after you do that I wait and you know by applying the same product three times you are really getting in um, the ingredients and then to really have it soaked into the inner layers I use the mask I showed you in the last video that it had all this um, audio introduction or audio instruction as um, for you to follow so it will tell you you know I'll begin the treatment for nine minutes and stuff like that but I've been hearing it for, for so many times I've actually muted so um, it's mute now but I think when I turned here you saw the LED lights coming out um, so yeah, that was on. So I would do that for 9 minutes and then I just try to relax. Spring skincare is really, uh, you know, focusing on cleansing your skin well so that you don't have any pollutants, micro dust or anything in your face. And then having your skin rejuvenated with uh, serum or with, you know, product of your desire and then really have it soaked um, and even though I do have irritation here you know it's it's a lot less than what I uh, first had you know when the spring began because seriously micro dust is a huge problem um, yeah and over the weeks I think um, I've had good impression of it because I do feel that my skin feels stronger if you know what I mean it does feel uh, tighter, like my pores feel tighter and also it just feels healthier so that uh, usually you know in the springtime when I double cleanse uh, my face or when I you know have irritation I do feel that my skin is a little tired but with this um, I've had the device on every day and I think it has enhance my core balance of the skin so it feels healthier and I recommend that if you're committed then I, I do recommend the beauty device if, if, uh, if not then you know uh, maybe you just want to rely on cosmetics or a clinic but I think if you want something in the middle so if you want something stronger than cosmetics uh, but you cannot really afford or you know either time or money to go to clinic every single time uh, that you have issue then just for a long-term maintenance and also a uh, long-term enhancement I recommend a beauty device like such and um, it's only useful though uh, that you are committed to use it you know regularly because otherwise it's it's not a skin clinic where you go and you know have the treatment done and then it's okay right away it does need time it's a long care routine um, so it's only effective if you are committed to it but I think I am and I'm going to keep use it and then you know let you know I guess in the long term how I feel about it but yeah I do feel the effect of it and hope um, that those of you who are watching and those of you who uh, are going to use it um, to see good results as well um, so thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one Bye!